We had a classic pitcher's duel in this Braves Cardinals series finale. Spencer Strider, he was coming out hot, pumping the fastball up to 100. And in the first three innings, he faced 10 batters, got nine outs, and all nine of those were on strikeouts. So his first nine outs were all via strikeout. Spencer Strider, he has just been getting better as the season is going on. And he's been known for his quads, his mustache, and now, most importantly, his performance on the field as it was more domination from Strider tonight. He went six shutout innings, only allowing two hits and Kane 12 Cardinals as the Braves were looking to four-game sweep the Cardinals. But after Spencer Strider, there were some more pitching performances. And it's going to be Jordan Hicks. He is pumping 104 miles per hour to Marcelo Zuna. He's going to finish it off with 93 on the corner to strike him out. Those were the fastest pitches in the MLB since 2019 when Jordan Hicks hit 104 and 105 in a game. Now, it's going to be Michael Harris. He's going to be tying the game. The rookie has been huge for Atlanta all year. Having him come out of your nine spot is a luxury, as he has definitely been very impressive for a rookie. So that ties up the game. Now we're headed to extras. It's the bottom of the 10th. Matt Olson. he's coming through huge. He was 5-for-5 five five with runners in scoring position this four-game series. So that's definitely huge to come through in clutch moments like that. So that's going to tie the game up. But then in the top of the 11th, it's going to be Dylan Carlson. He had himself a three-hit night. That just gets into the outfield. So the Cardinals will win this one. They're going to avoid the sweep with some very exciting pitching performances. Spencer Strider, Matthew Liebertor, Jordan Hicks, and more.